Hello students. I know that you are preparing for your NIT exam. So here I have prepared some questions uh, which I believe that uh, uh, you, that will help you uh, to prepare for your exams better. So let us move into the questions now. I have given answers also. Uh, first question, who is the uh, father of American structuralism? So who is the father of American structuralism? Leonard Bloomfield. Second question, a rhythm counted not by syllables and regular feet, but by stresses is called sprung rhythm. Popularized by, I believe you know, Hopkins, yes. Third question, Cowley, Crowshaw and Marvel are described as metaphysical poets. So done as a pioneer, you know. Fourth question, the fallacy of using meaning in the definition of grammatical categories is called semantic fallacy. Next, Lady Bellaston is a character in Tom Jones. Uh, that is Henry Fielding, by right? Henry Fielding. Sixth question, in the political allegory of uh, Gulliver's uh, first voyage, which are the two countries satirized? Answer is England and Ireland. Seventh one, Savage is a character in Huxley's which novel? Huxley is a brave new world. Savage is a character. Gasworthy's trilogy of novels is called End of the Chapter, which was published in the year 1925. Tenth question, in whose novel does the motif of blood consciousness appear? D.H. Lawrence. Eleventh, dash deals with the way phonemes are combined to form syllables. So phonotactic tactics. In Hebrew mythology, who is called Lord of the Flies? Beelzebub. Thirteenth question, the Merchant of Venice by Shakespeare is modeled upon Marlowe's play. So, what is the title of the play? The Jew of Malta. The only play by Shakespeare to have chorus is Pericles. The author of The Lady is Not for Burning is Christopher Fry. The autobiography of Coleridge is called Biographia Literaria, which was published in the year 1817. The battle of books is between ancient and modern so the battle was between ancient and modern so belinda is a character in the poem the rape of the lock mention the subtitle of words words so the prelude the prelude the subtitle is growth of a poet's mind we can die by it if not live by love identify the poem it's uh, from canonization by dunn and next uh, question 21st, the last tale in Canterbury Tales is actually Parsons' Tale. And uh, the next question, the concluding line of Spenserian stanza is called Iambic Hexameter or Alexandrine. 23rd, Dash is a sonnet of ten and a half lines. It is Hopkins' Pike Beauty. The most famous writer of James Bond novels was Ian Fleming, who said Shakespeare has no heroes, only heroines. John Ruskin. 26th question. Which classical writer did Pope model his satires on? Horace. The symbol sick rose was famously used by which writer? William Blake has used in his works. Uh, imagism was influenced by the aesthetic theories of T. Hume. Four legs good, two legs bad. This is a quotation from which work? This quotation is from George Orwell's animal form. Next question. Touchstone, the clown is a character in which play? So Touchstone comes in Shakespeare's As You Like It. So if you see, I have discussed the 30 questions here with answers. I believe this would have helped you 